Hello and welcome back to the channel. Animated Alex here. Hope you're doing well. Death Chase. My recreation of this famous ZX Spectrum game that was originally created by Mervyn Estcourt in 1983. 16K of RAM was used to create this. So I've been trying to create it using only Sinclair Basic, pure Basic in 48K. How have I got on? Well, it's been a tough ride. The biggest obstacle in the programming has been those trees. Trying to fine tune those trees to get them looking something close to the original. Obviously, I'm not going to get it 100%. There's no way I'm going to get it 100%, but I've given it a go and I've kind of got that 3D feel and that vision of what that game was like back then. Well, I feel I have anyway, in my personal opinion. Obviously, it's 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 not 100%. It's not going to be. We're talking about Sinclair Basic here, for goodness sake, unless I start going into machine code. And if I'm going to do that, why bother? You just, well, buy the original and play that game. But anyway, I've given it a good go. And like I said, I wasted way too much time on those trees trying to fine tune them now the problem i had is with the controls when you're moving left and right i've actually programmed it so you're moving the trees to give you that illusion that you are moving the motorcycle in this case i called it a just a push bike because it's basic and it's slow so i gave it the illusion of movement by moving the trees Obviously, I had to have a space either side of those trees because I didn't want it reprinting a tree every time it moved left or right, if you see what I'm saying. This caused a lot of problems with being able to put in more trees because obviously they would be deleted because of that space of block that was in the way. So I couldn't add more trees because of that reason. I did try, for those of you who are familiar with Sinclair Basic programming, the old um, method of delete the old position. And here's a little example of that, this bit of programming here. But because of the size of the graphics and the lines it was taking up, I did try it, but it didn't work, unfortunately. It just slowed it up, if anything, and it didn't get rid of the problem. It could have been because of my, perhaps, lack of Sinclair basic knowledge to date. You know, I'm still learning. I've only been learning basic since the 24th of November 2024. You know, so what I've done, I'm quite proud of myself because I've managed to create something. Like I said, I wasted way too much time trying to fine tune those trees. And there comes a time where you've just got to say stop you know enough is enough except with what you've got and try and just make it playable and tr you know i was i was set on trying to make it so much like the original and it's just not doable in basic you know just make it look something like it and run with it so that's what i've done so that's why we've only got at one time on the screen, you'll see two trees moving towards you. That's all I could achieve. I put some trees in the background just to give it that little bit of ambience that you're in a forest. But as the game progressed, the more I added into it, it started to get slower and slower. So then I decided the only way to go with this is compile it with Mcoder 3. It's a fast moving game, Def Chase, so mine has to be fast moving too. Because it was so slow, it was embarrassingly slow and it was boring. You know, it, um, I just couldn't bring it to myself to release that. It had to be compiled, so that's the route I took. It's been compiled and this has been one hell of a challenge. And, and I'm looking forward to the next one. So please, in the comments, Tell me what you would like me to try next. Anyway, going back to Dev Chase, I wanted something to shoot at just to make it more of a, a, a bit of a, a game, if you like. So I tried to add a, a motorbike. Wasn't very happy with that. 
so got rid of that so i've settled for just two quad bikes that go across the screen and you've got to shoot at them so you've got one quad bike that goes from the left hand side of the screen and then in, uh, during the game one will go on the right hand side of the screen and just shoot them and and race through the trees this here is the compiled version and this will be the version that i will eventually release on my itch account i'm going to play it to death if you like over the next week to make sure there's nothing wrong with it and it's acceptable as a game to put on my account but that's it i'm not doing any more to it i've done what i can do like i said earlier my programming abilities have been stretched to their limit so what you see is what you get and i just want to say to all those viewers who voted on me to do def chase thank you very much i've enjoyed it it's been a headache i'm not going to lie to you but i've learned a lot from this project and that's what i like about basic you're just continuously learning and learning and maybe one day when i've learned a bit more I might return to it and maybe get those trees working a little bit better than I have. But for now, thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one.